Hello, Jürgen. Um, I just wondered, are there any similarities to that um, 2014-15 season in Dortmund? Anything that you learn from that period that you, with your experience now, you can apply to another difficult period? Look, it's it's just you make it, I, I, it's clear. I'm Jurgen Klopp. I was at Dortmund. I had a, a, a situation at Dortmund after a very successful spell, and then uh, it's not that easy. That you, it's not it's not even close. The 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 the, the situation at, at Dortmund was not half as. I'm not sure bad. So like from an injury point of view, not we're not half as bad as it is here. Not half, and we had much less points after the first part of the season. The difference was we had injuries and it was a reason and we had it was in, in the first part of the season was similar. In the second part they all came back. They all came back. We had a winter break and I knew when the, after the last game of the first part of the season and we have a winter break and I knew when we start with the preseason for the second part of the season, all the players will be back. So and and it's it's a completely different situation because nobody Pretty much nobody comes back here. That's not a problem. It just means that's, that's not, uh, you cannot compare it. You cannot compare it because you have to find solutions and it doesn't stop. <laughs> it's, it's like, again, you, uh, you, 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 know, you change again and you change again and you change. And you have to change because then things don't work. You, can, yeah, you cannot say, okay, come on, let it be like this or whatever. Um, we, we, we work on it, but you, it's not that easy that you are in a situation like this, like Ill, seven, eight years ago. Um, and I would just take out the book where you wrote all your notes in and, 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 and have a look, ah, yeah, that's what we can do. The only thing you can do is to work as hard as you can, to fight as much as you can, to play as good as you can, to win football games, because that changes everything. Fantastic. Thank you very much, Rob. We'll go to Jonathan Northcroft and then Simon Muller to finish. Hi, Jürgen. Hi. Hi. Um, I, mean, I, I think, as you said earlier, you're the first group of people to, to analyse your own performance. Uh, and I just wonder, does it, in terms of you as a manager, is this, does this leave you sort of questioning every single aspect and looking for little things you might be able to do differently? Or is it more a case of looking at what's been good in the past and saying, I don't have to change it? Just, just from a personal point of view, how do you treat this sort of situation? Didn't understand it. Sorry, didn't understand the question. Sorry, sorry, Jürgen. I'm just in terms of you analysing um, and looking at every little angle. Are you looking at you know what you and what your staff are doing and, and, oh, and searching for things me, that might be different? Me personally. Yes. Yeah, oh, part yeah. Of the process. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's it's not, of course. But it's not about. <laughs> Ah, I think somebody asked a question if I'm some sometimes too nice or whatever. Mm -hmm. So these kind of things. So I'm 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 like I am. So I'm, and I'm not always nice. I would like to be, but I'm not. Um, and I'm we are we are loud, we are critical, we are everything. So it's not like this. So you cannot change now. But I'm not always nice, and now I'm always not, or whatever. That's not how it works. From a football point of view, yes, we try to adapt. We try to adapt, and obviously. We don't adapt quick enough, otherwise we would have more results and better results. So again, and that's the, the criticism we face. But it, again, we cannot do then our best. And um, it's it's how it is, and it's always how it is. If somebody thinks there's another one who can do it better, then of course, then 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 that that has to they have to make the decision. That's clear. Um, I don't think that's a case. Not that it, nobody can do it better, but I don't think that anybody of the deciders have that opinion. Um, at least nobody told me. And um, but it's not that you can change now everything. We change football things, yes. I mean, but we are not. When we win football games, we are not constantly partying. And if we lose them, we are not punching each other's face. So that's not that easy. It's just somewhere in between you need to find before a game this kind of belief and optimism and positivity again to go in the game and play because it's a game and that's what we kind of always did um, most of the time at least I saw that in the games we had our shares of the games we had big parts of the games and we lost them last night I spoke to Thomas Tuchel and after the game he said well, he analyzed us obviously he didn't understand how we lost this and this and this game. You saw them. It's it's not to explain really. So if a, a game you lose because you perform bad, you can change. If you perform good and you lose it anyway, but not for because the other the opponent was that much better just because they 
were lucky or in one moment um, we made a mistake. We had all, we had all kind of defeats this year. <laughs> Not a lot of performing completely beyond under our our pos our, our um, ability, and we lost it. And clear that was maybe. Aston Villa, for sure. Even that game it was strange, but no, it's it's all that's that's all clear. But that makes it so complex. That makes the situation just so complex. It's not about we change this and it works again. No, we have to we have to adapt to our situation. We have to prepare for the opponent, and then we still have to play the game. And in football games, always could can happen strange things. And this season, a lot of strange things happened. Very rarely. To on our, it was it happened to uh, for a positive for us, um, and that's it. Great. And final question, Simon Mullock. Hi, Jurgen. Hi. Um, you, you've you've said that it's going to be a real battle just to finish in the top four this season. <laughs> um, it, yeah, that's an understatement. Um, given that the schedule is not going to get any easier from now until the end of the season, do you envisage a? A time, maybe in a month or so, when you, when you'll know what the situation is in terms of the top four, where you you, you concentrate absolutely any everything in trying to win the Champions League again, and maybe uh, you know sort of play sort of weakened teams in the Premier League because obviously the, the winning the Champions League, although a difficult route, does offer a route back into the Champions League next season. Wow, that's an interesting view. Now we have, we have played our full limit. Three days, three days later, we played Leipzig, and we are not in the next round. So I, I can't think yeah. about winning the Champions League uh, now. Really, in in, in a sense of um, we, we have to go through um, diff difficult um, rounds, and this round is difficult. Um, no, I, I don't know. I, I don't know. I didn't think that far. Obviously, um, this week it's it's like this. We play these three games again late in the season now with two days in between so it's Thursday Sunday Wednesday uh, which is um, is tough so we will see who we can field on Sunday and then we make a decision who we can field who we can bring on on, on, on Wednesday but it's not because we what is that gave up on the um, in, in the Premier League over that that will never happen that will never happen. You see, there's no game we can play and, and we lose it and people say, oh, with that lineup. So Liverpool is too big. Too many people are interested. Um, that we say, we, we don't play behind closed doors, really. So without cameras and just you can read in the news how the result was. It's in front of our people and we feel the responsibility that in each game we have to give our absolute everything to win it. That that doesn't happen, and people think no, that's not enough. That doesn't change our attitude. We try it again, and next time Sunday 